The fourth eruption of the Sunuka crater chain in the Reykjanes Peninsula of Iceland was strange. It is started like the usual way, but in two fissures, like three previous ones. But what was interesting, it was not the cluster of the earthquakes or the shape of the tremors chart. It was the, the way that the GPS data was showing that this eruption is different. It was, a, it was not a continuation of the trend that we had in the three previous eruptions. It was going with different slope, different shape. And uh, when we look at the volumes of the magma involved in, in, in this fourth eruption, that adds to the oddity of this case. We have up to, latest data is that, up to 35 million cubic meters of magma erupted from that. The reservoir of the sourcing volcanic system, which contributed to the three previous ones, was from 8 to 13, sometimes to 18 million cubic meters. Nothing like what erupted this time. This time at least around twice that amount. Sourcing volcanic system cannot erupt that amount of the magma. The volume of it is this what is written 8 to 13 usually and we had the maximum 18 this time this is related to the uh, late march around 35 34 to 36 million cubic meters sourcing a volcanic system was not contributing to this was not responsible for this eruption a deeper source was involved it is speculated that the source at the depth of 8 to 12 kilometers was involved. Pulling a part of the uh, land masses of Eurasia and the Americas, creating a rift valley in the uh, Swarsengi area, of, I have named it Grift, Grindavik Rift Valley, is the range and basin, practically brought up and rose the uh, mantle of the earth higher. And what was doing is that this thinning of the crust, melting the top part of the magma, and erupting from there. What we are seeing in here, and we have seen in the, to the last moment of it, was not a volcanic eruption with the magma chamber contributing to it. I believe this was an ophiolite sequence directly from the mantle of the earth. This was lucky that we saw this on the land, Although we cannot see the sequence of it, the cross-section of it, but we have good uh, understanding of, of uh, how the ophiolite sequences look like. And this one looks like nothing similar to what we had in Swartzengi, but very similar to the other one.